Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the WordPress video series. In this video, I'll show you how to customize the shop page using the Astra theme. On this demo website, I'm using Astra theme. Here you can see that I have the free Astra theme installed and I'm also using Astra Pro plugin. However, I'm not going to use the Astra Pro plugin to customize the shop page. So here I'm going to deactivate the Astra Pro plugin. And after that, I'm going to customize the shop page. Later, we will activate the Astra Pro plugin and we will see what are the customizations that we can do using the Astra Pro plugin. So here you can see that I have deactivated the Astra Pro plugin. So let's go to the shop page and here you can go to customize. So here we are on the customization page. It's not necessary that you need to go to shop page and then go to customize. You can go to any page and from there you can click on customize. It will go to the customization section. Here you can go to WooCommerce and go to product catalog. So this is basically the option to customize the shop page in Astra. Now this is the container layout. This is the entire container. If you want to change it to boxed or content boxed, full width, full width stretch. So I'm going to leave it as it is. And here you will see sidebar layout. So here we are using the sidebar in the right side. You will see a right sidebar is activated here. If you want full width, no sidebar, you can select no sidebar option. And this is how it will look. So on the shop page, it will show only the products. If you want it on the left hand side, you can use the left hand sidebar. And this is how it will look. In this sidebar, you will see the product filter widget. This is a separate plugin that I have installed to create the WooCommerce product filter. I have published a separate video on how to use the free WooCommerce products filter. I'll give you the link in the description box. If you want to activate this kind of product filter on your WooCommerce website, you can watch that video. Now here in this case, I'm going to use the right sidebar. Right now, let's go to the shop layout. Now here you will see different types of cards. Let me change the shop columns here. Right now it is using three columns. I'm going to change it to two columns so that you can see it properly. So you will see two column shop products. You will see all the products in the two column. And here you will see products per page. So right now it is set to 24. So you will see 24 products on the shop page. And if you have more than 24, it will go to the next page. Now, here you will see show products. So what do you want to show on the shop page products? Otherwise you can select categories and it will show the categories instead of products. So you will see these are the categories. I do not have any images for the categories. So it's not showing any images. Another option is show subcategories and products. So you will see some subcategories and you will see products. Let's change it to show products. If you want to change it to sort by price, let's select this one and you will see change in the shop product. Mostly these are same price products, $9. Here you can change the sorting options for the products. Now let's go to, let me change it to default one. Now what do you want to show here? Price, here you will see the price category which is the category and title and after that add to cart button you will see these options here if i disable category you will see the category will go away from here so now there is no category title if you disable the title it will go away it will disappear obviously i want to show the title and below that you have the i add to cart button now if you want to show the ratings you can show the ratings Right now, here you will see these products, these dummy products do not have any rating. However, if you want to show it, you can show it here. Short description. So it will show the description of the product, just like this. If you want to move it, just build the title. You can change the position from here, just like this. So this is how it will look. It will show the short description here. And here you will see the other options that you can customize using the Astra Pro plugin. So we will activate the Astro Pro plugin and we will see those options later. Now let's go to the shop card design. There are two options for the shop card design. Let's check the second one. And this is how it will look. You will see the sale option here. You will see add to cart here. So there is a slight change here. Let's go to the design option. 
and you will see that the design options or the customization is available only for the pro plugin this is the content alignment right left and center let's make it center align all right let's publish this one and let's see how does this look let me open the website and let's go to the shop page and this is how it will look we have made some changes you will see the ratings here title description and add to cart button and here you will see the cart design sale option and the add to cart button is also here let's go back to the plugins and activate the pro plugin this is the astro pro plugin if you want to buy it i'll give you the link in the description box so we have got the astro pro plugin installed activated here you will see the options for the astro pro plugin if you have it enabled these are the astro pro models that you can use you can change the colors and background you can you just need to enable it typography or you can simply activate all let's activate all of them so all these models will be activated all right now let's go back to customize and let's refresh it we are back to the shop page customization and i'm going to disable the short description from here all right now let's go back to the design option and you will see all the design options are available because we have enabled the astop pro plugin now here you can change the product title color price you can change the colors from here let's change the color to blue this is the title color you will see the change here product price uh, let's make it red and product content we are not using any content the product background color let's change it to somewhat like this so we have got the background color for the product now here you will see product image hover style let's change it to zoom now here you will see the zoom animation now button padding this is the button and if you want to add some padding you can add it let's add 10 pixel all sides this is for the button this button content padding this is for the content box shadow if you want to add box shadow you can add the box shadow this is the box you will see the shadow here just like this you can see the changes here you will see the box shadow this one looks good this is box hover shadow now here you will see product title font if you want to change the font you can change the font from here price font or the title font let's go back to general tab and what other options do we have here this is the boxed one now here you will see we have got one more shop card design right now it is set to design 2 we can change it to design 3 and let's see how does this look so this is how it will look this is the design 3 so here we have the image in the left hand side and the content on the right hand side let's go back to design 2 and add one more column here right now it is set to 2 we are going to change it to 3 columns let's change it to full width stretched this one also looks good so this is how it will look we have changed the column to full width or you can change it full width contained now here you will see different option display page title display breadcrumbs if you want to add the breadcrumbs you can add the breadcrumbs also enable sticky sidebar so we will enable this sticky sidebar here these are all the pro options so if i move the products page you will see that the sidebar is still at the same position it is sticky now so this is one of the best feature if you have some advertisement or if you have product filter in the sidebar you can make it sticky now quick view if you want to use quick view that is also available here you will see the quick view is added so we have got another icon on the image so if you want to change it you can change the location of the quick view on image click so if someone clicks on image it will show the quick view 
so i'm going to leave it as it is now here you will see shop pagination pagination is nothing but these numbers here or you can have infinite scrolls these buttons will go and all the products will be listed on the same page so when someone scroll down it is going to load more products now here you will see shop filter button you will see the button here added filter so this is the shop filter button these are all features added because we have enabled the astop pro plugin right let's publish it let's go back to the shop page and refresh it now you will see the customized shop page here you will see the filter option now if you want to assign a widget you can click on it and we need to assign a widget here here you will see the shop filter so here you can add the shop filter widget so i'm going to copy this one so we already have one woocommerce filter so i'm going to use the same one here copy this block and i'm going to shop filter and i'm going to paste the block here so we have got this sidebar here so i'm going to update it let's go back to the shop page again now when i click on filter you will see the woocommerce product filter option so this is the same widget that i have added in this filter option so you will see the new card design is there it is three column you will see quick view if i click on it it will show the quick view of the product so this is how you can customize the shop page in astra theme using the astra pro plugin so that's it for now see you in the next video do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools. If you have any questions, please leave us message in comments section. And press the like button if you like the video. Thanks for watching Quick Tips.